What's up guys and welcome back to another video right into my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to basically tell you how to fix this issue if your Red Dead Redemption 2 isn't starting or isn't launching properly. So stick to the end guys, this will be a step-by-step -step tutorial. In the end you will probably know what to do in order to fix these issues. Before we start right into the video, I just wanted you guys to know, let you guys know that I would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like, a comment or a subscription right onto my YouTube channel. It would really make my day and help me out as a little YouTuber as I am. Especially subscribing would be a big support for me guys. You would support my work here on YouTube a little bit and I'm gonna really be thankful for that. So I would just say let's get right started. So as the first step, I want you to basically open up your task manager by just clicking the taskbar or using the shortcut. So right click on the taskbar, open up your task manager. Once you're here, I want you to navigate to the top left corner of your screen, clicking onto processes and just ensure that you're sticking around that. And what I want you to do right here is gonna to be to click one of those processes, doesn't really matter which one, and type in R to search for Red Dead Redemption 2. If nothing pops up, it's good for you. If something pops up, I want you to right click it and, and simply end the task. So once you're finished here, I want you to close the task manager again. And what I want you to do next is going to be to use your Steam shortcut in your desktop. And if you don't have it on your desktop, I want you to navigate to the bottom left corner of your screen using your Windows search function in order to find Steam and drag it right onto your desktop. So once you have it on your desktop, I want you to right click it and navigate to the very bottom where it says properties. Once your properties pop up, I want you to comp click on compatibility and basically just copy my settings, so let's quickly run through it. I want you to go to compatibility mode, enable run this program in compatibility mode 4, select Windows 8, disable the disable full screen optimizations as well as run this program or enable and run this program as an administrator. So once you're finished here, I want you to click apply and OK. I would personally recommend you restart your PC afterwards, so once it is restarted, you should be able to see this little administrator symbol uh, on your Steam shortcut, and I want you to double click Steam, basically just start up Steam, and launch the game over the launcher, and you should be able to fix this issue by you doing that. So guys, that's it for the video, I hope I could actually help you out with this one. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment, or a subscription, I'm gonna really be thankful for that. I'm really sorry if I couldn't help you, but I'm just going to do my best in order to help you out. Either way, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See you at the next one and bye.